<clears throat> right. And we're back for part nine. 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 E or maybe ten. Uh sometimes counting with Joe doesn't work out. Um I remember that I'd got ready to just to immediately click yes. So we shall continue. Um right. You I don't think I will build a defense fleet for you. I don't have the MC. So, I'm probably going to build more than two. PDA. Three. PDA. Um, free PDA? That might be enough. We'll go with free. See how that works out. Uh, so, one, two, three, one, two, three. Two shipyards. I don't think I need a third shipyard. So, construction module. And then another. And this one I can be a solo array. Since you're going to take for a long time. Um, I'm not building anything out of you for a while, I don't think. So, I will upgrade you now. So, therefore, I can upgrade them now. Yeah. Right, that's how I'll do that. <clears throat> Um, twenty twenty nine is quite a while away, but I don't think I want to put three pips on, on it just yet. Yeah, like Saturn isn't like isn't isn't a huge huge priority, so. Oh yeah, I was waiting for the other one to arrive there, wasn't I? To see if that would maybe work? Um... <laughs> it's like, hmm... All dressed up and nowhere to go. Okay. Not sending anything. I guess that mothership is a concern. It depends on what it does once it arrives at Bertha. And that one as well. Because if they then make a beeline to my assets, there's another dreadnought coming. 
I could be in a world of hurt. So... See, I always go... I always go China next. <sighs> but... <sighs> MC-wise, it's going to be really poor, and I need MC. A lot more MC this time around. Um... Maybe it is worth taking the EU instead. Way actually, um, so France is nearly done, so is the Netherlands or oh. the Benelux. So is Greece. Maybe I do take the EU instead of China. Because I'd get a lot of more MC out of that. And a lot of regions, well, Eastern Europe hasn't built anything. But you're nearly done. You're nearly done. You're nearly done. You're nearly done. Hmm. The trick is is to take the um not take France, but take the other nations. So that way the AI, the AI can't, um, because if you take if you take France, then the AI will literally just start dropping out of the EU, and then it takes you forever to get it all back in together. So you got to work your way um, inwards, really. But that takes a lot of MC, ups, uh, CP cap. Hmm. Have a greater India one zero zero. They haven't worked on that at all. <sighs> Work on MC, you assholes. Also, I think you can you can get Myanmar now. They added that in the new patch for Greater India. Hmm. So you're actually doing fairly well for mission control. Servants are actually uh, working in Indonesia okay-ish. Like, it's not, it's still a bit bad. Like, they don't need all that boost. Well, they might do. But they're not working on any military, which is good. Hmm. 
Hmm. Is anyone working? Let me see in Africa. Egypt. It's nearly done. But that's about it, it looks like. Hmm. Saudi. Not touching Russia with a ten foot pole. Such a useless region. Canada is actually pushing along. Like other than the inequality, um, Canada is actually looking pretty strong. Twelve. It's 36 points. I don't know. I usually take India, uh, China because it's such a powerful economy. But it has a fair number of... It has a fair number of regions. Well, I don't know why I did that. Um, and then obviously there's the strategy of you take Taiwan and you give China to Taiwan and suddenly you have a full democracy China. I'll wait. I think I'll, I'll stick to my like. I I, t I tend to be, just prefer like North America, and then all of Southeast Asia. Generally, um, right. Okay. Anyway, um, you are going to defend Denmark because I forgot. Got you, and that's about it. I wonder if it's worth uh, releasing Greenland now. Like, I only, it's only like one. I, well, it'll be easy to take because I'm over the cap limit, so I should wait. I love one going for a troop call. They really don't like that. It's three fleets going for it now. Okay, another one for Bertha Wade. But there's like, a, it's a year out, so it's like, that ship's probably not even going to be there in a year. <laughs> Either uh, it'll die for something else, or I'll uh, scuttle it. Because it can't go anywhere. And I might end up needing the MC. Alright, when do you run out? August. January. <laughs> Fine, I will defend you. I don't want to, but I will defend you. Um, and then I guess I will. A two two. But 
Do I need a 2-2? Two -two? Um, not really. Well, mm, I can grab it and sell off one of my ones that are just two. You, I remember, was going to do an admin. And then I was going to sort all this out to give you the NGIA. So I will buy that now, move that over, and then get rid of one of these. And you get NGIA. Um, and then that gives you max investigation. Look at that. Um, so I don't really need it. Didn't really need that, but oh well. <laughs> this is for, I guess, the time when I'm going to need to kill an alien. So I have two, four, six, eight, ten espionage I can quickly add on. That's not too bad. Um, but now I want to put Lutheran Terre back on someone. Mm, ah. Hmm. Mm. You, I know I'm placing jot games with that. You, you're not as good as that. Um. Okay. Wow. Well, here comes the doom stack. I guess cybernetics. Um. Right now, you are to do advanced neural networks. I'll get that with layer defense away. Oh right, yeah. I removed the thing that gave you stabilization. So you can advise India and you can stabilize India. Ham You are close to completion. Um. Right, layer defense array is just completed, isn't it? So I need to go to. Uh, 
Accelerate upgrade for you. And you. And you. Layer defense upgrade for you. And you. And you. Righty ho. I think I need more resources. So I'm going to build up. Get more outposts. Uh, right. <sighs> eh. I'll go with you. There's a thirty one point two there, actually. Yeah, I'm going to grab that. Um, I don't think fissiles is going to be as um, important, uh, as critical this game round. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I'll build two, one at Callisto and one at Ganymede just to... Um, I already did the whole thing, didn't I, where I made new versions of ships, didn't I? Yes. Um, nothing else dropped. No. Um... But what I do need to build are pipe. No, not pythons. Valentifs. Yes. One, two, three. Um. It is kind of annoying. Um, this bug where they're not being removed. I suppose I need, in a sense, I need fewer defense ships at Jupiter because they don't have anything, they don't have any stations in the inner system, so anything that they send has a long lead up time, and so therefore I can reinforce those fleets with the ones from the other stations. Or just have one fleet that moves between them all. Um. Medium IR laser? Yeah. 
of the destroyers. But it's not critical. Um, we'll go with that. Alright, Mercury Fleet is good to go. <clears throat> I don't think you'll risk it being attacked, so I shall put the solar array rather than PDA. Drive, we're not going to be using. Um, you've got pretty good metal. You're more balanced, I think, Absusuki. So I'll go with you. Um, go sit back at the Xeno Station, why not? Um, Savantis is the Earth one. Okay. Um, wait. Okay, it's just a Corvette. Three PDA, three LDAs will be fine on that. Um. Eighth of September is the first assault. So I'll probably send the Ganymede fleet to reinforce that, I think, because I don't really I don't feel like I need to build and load defense ships at the moment. So I'm pretty not safe, but knowing that it's going to take the aliens like a year to get to me, it's a pretty good deal. Um, you go back to rising, I guess, for the moment.
Okay. It's great because they're sending all these ships at stuff that I'm going to get rid of. But because they're already in their uh, transit, they can't do anything about it until they arrive. So I've essentially forced the aliens to build ships, or spend resources on ships, and have those ships be on uh, year long trajectories that are going to be completely pointless. So, in a sense, I am tying up a lot of the alien assets pretty well. I need you for laser batter laser defense arrays. On the batteries. And I fab. Okay, dokie. Continue on with them. Nothing much on that front to do worry about. Right. Um. When does that second ship? 36 days, so that one arriving at Callisto arrives before. Yeah. So I'll need to send I think I'll have to send all of them, actually, to Callisto. Yeah. You can't even go to Callisto. Uh, but you can go to... Uh, you should be able to go to Ganymede. Yeah. Right, and then... Uh, Patrophis Raid. Why is... Why did I name that one? Vesta Raid. That's weird. Um, you are not Vesta Raid. You are Patroclus Raid. Patroclus <coughs> Raid. Right. Huh. Bit of an issue there with it. Raid, we salute you. You who are about to uh, not commit suicide because they decided to. Um, <laughs> they decided to upgrade the PDA to an LDA. So suddenly they don't actually have any defenses. <laughs> That's hilarious. Um, all right then. Now they are completely clean of the uh, of bases. It Outside of, inside of Jupiter. Nice, 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 nice. What I need now, though. Hmm. What I need now is to check 
F. The fox. What is its timing to get from like... Um... Say Callist say Xeno Station to Vesta. Forty four weeks. Forty five weeks. And that's with the fox. Hmm. So it's June next year, plus 60 days to build, They're looking at August-September time. I'm just wondering if I can build ships to, like, intercept these things? But I don't think so. Nah, the aliens move too fast. I need to wait until I have, like, the next tier of engines, to be honest. Um... Alright, IO. You're getting resupplied already. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, yeah, Mercury was done. Um, Mercury Station Donatello. Great, it's not repair. Um, it's to be replaced. Oh well. Can't do anything about it now. And then you move on to Callisto. Right, uh, and what I want to do is refit Merkel into the outpost version. You can resupply, so you can have full amounts of. Right. That's an interesting idea. Because a lot of the times they have to transition around like the sun to get from one side to the other. I wonder if I could build ships at Mercury that can like intercept them. Like, um, let's have a. I wouldn't be able to do it with these because they're too slow, I think, but. Yeah. It's an interesting thought for future consideration. Um. Right, you undock. Although I can't really do anything yet until you finish prospecting.
cybernetics soon. <clears throat> um, oh, another two star cog. Also an MC, but it's a two star MC. Which I'm less excited about. That is straight up better than that. I'm gonna get swap you out. Um, so I've got you two. I can replace with that. Uh, check other people though first. Uh huh. What about you? That one's better. No. Ah, uh, you also have admin point. Counting with Joe, nine, thirteen, nineteen, twenty-three, twenty-seven. Which means I think I can get rid of you. I can get rid of you. Um, right. Moving on. Not you yet. Eh. I could replace you two, but then I'd lose one science. So might as well just wait. Um, more counting with Joe, nine, thirteen, eighteen, twenty two, twenty six. Can't get rid of any of you yet. Okay. I'm going to get rid of you. And you. And grab you. And then... I have a space. So I don't have to sell anything. Good, good. Put some more social on, I suppose. <laughs> Um, for now, I'd rather just like do that since having cap isn't um, dire. I love that new ability for it just to resupply, it's so good. Saves so much clicking. Um, I don't know if I need marine assault units yet, really. Um, I don't need cruisers yet. Don't really need supply to grow, don't need that. Don't need that at all really. I could get these. Don't need ECM. I'm already doing an alien tech one, so let's do management again. Why not? Um 
That's all right. I'll be unlocking new tech soon. All right, so now I have the fleets at Callisto in prep. All right, take me there. Alpha 19, you get an owl found. What's we, what do we have here? Oh, 11.8. There we go. I kind of need that. Donatello. You know, I kind of just realized that I haven't, um, I don't think I've researched, uh, settlements. <laughs> um... Um, I kind of want settlements sooner rather than later, so I will do it after advanced atomic manipulation. Um. You no, you um, eh. I'll have three bases on Mercury to start, or should I just have two? I'll have three bases, I think, since the, uh, the, the research change means I'm going to have to put a lot of op centers down instead. Um, probably. Advanced Atomic Manipulation, right, I'll get Settlement Habs, since I kind of need that. Um, right, and then one more time. My nobles is a bit low, to be honest. Yeah. To repair. I suppose that is one disadvantage of that system. I don't know if that actually was implemented or not for me to not, so that it was it won't do that. Because obviously now I've just wasted repairing it when I'm going to scuttle it. So I've wasted some resources, but I didn't set a home port for it. So I don't know. Okay. You're still sitting at Vesta to lend your thumbs. You're arriving in nine days. Okay. I guess I'm really going to be in trouble. If they decide to send all those ships at my stuff. Um, 
so maybe I should actually uh, start building the third escort. I can never remember which one it is. You, isn't it? V uh, Vilentif, yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, that should be fine for now. Uh, I also can design I can also design the destroyer. Not too bad. And you're not your patrol. Okay, so I've got some destroyer headers for when I need to. I wonder what does a pulsar corvette look like? Twenty KPS. Nah, not even with advanced pulsar. Okie dokie. Ah, oh, look at that enjoyable alien conga land of death. That's gonna take uh, quite a while to arrive, but. Uh, the fun we're going to have soon, I think. Um, Alright, that's basically an hour. So I will stop at that point and continue on for part 10 or 9, whatever it is. <laughs>